premiere, I'm in the back with James Franco. Here we are with Daniel Craig and Westwood for the premiere of one of the Bond movies. Here we are with uh, Jackie Chan in Westwood again. This is probably one of my favorite pictures. This was taken in Korea. And here I am standing right in front of Angelie Jolie. Sony Pictures releases movies uh, about 12 to 15 per year. When they do that, they hold a marketing event, which they call a marketing event. It's really a red carpet premiere. My job is to liaison with the local police department, local fire department, the people who build the red carpet for us, talent security, and just make sure the event goes off safely and that everyone has a good time. During the red carpet event itself is a little bit more technical and a little bit more challenging because you have a lot of moving parts. Everything moves very fast. You have to pay attention to where all of your key talent are going, all of your key executives, uh, making sure that they meet timelines because everything's based around time. While the events are going, there's a whole bunch of stuff that's going on afterwards. You're starting to think about how do you get people out of the premiere, out of the theater, into the after party. You're thinking about how do we get them in their cars, what routes are they going to take. For everyone else, they just see us on the red carpet or they see us walking next to any actor or actress and they think it's really glamorous. And For us, it's really just another day. So I've worked with Secret Service, I've worked with Los Angeles Police Department, Los Angeles Sheriff's Department. I've worked with some special forces people in different countries as well and I've learned some tricks from them. I don't have two flashlights, I have three flashlights. Just things like that, little things like that that you pick up on from working with other people. There's a lot more to the work we do than just security and understanding the business side of it. My day-to-day -day job consists of managing a contracted security guard force of 160 security officers provided to us by a contracted security company. And we deal with daily issues, security officer, uh, opportunities for improvement, leadership, just the basic things that run the studio. I also have a little bit of a secret though, is that I was a reserve with the Pasadena Fire Department for about three years. And that is a huge learning experience because it really teaches you how to talk to people it, it changes how you approach people. The standard security response is, you know, don't do that, you can't go there. And, and there's that, that kind of rent-a-cop mentality. And it's so much more than that. You have to win people over. You have to engage them in, in your belief and what you need them to do. You have to talk to them. I have a great opportunity to look after and take care of a lot of our staff, a lot of the people that work for us. And for me, that's very rewarding. And it's, it's a personal drive. It, it's, it's something that's deep within who I am as a person, as a human, to take care of other people. So it's just, for me, it's, it's very self-satisfying. It's almost selfish because I get to participate in something that I really believe in.